or what to say to a radiant young queen when she confesses her dreams of becoming a mom. Sarah, when I first learned of your runway model ambitions, I panicked. Baby cousin, you were born eight seemingly split second years ago, sparkling with a shine so bright that everyone within a two kilometer radius of your smile was forced to wear sunglasses. The bounce in your stride made me think that you swapped out your shins for pogo sticks. You are miraculous. Which is why I want you to take the following morning on your impending career path very seriously. I'll try not to speak in absolutes. One, while you are caramel carved, cavity sweet, and tender snowflake graceful, these people are notoriously critical. It is their job to fiend for aesthetic perfection, holding you to atmospheric standards, and their indirect mind games may chisel away at your confidence like fine, fragile china, leaving behind dust and shards for self-esteem, too. The pressure that you can put on yourself would be even worse. You may magnify every weight that they throw on your shoulder to a size that would strike sympathy in Atlas himself. Because this world has always taught you to take challenges head on, to battle as bold against oncoming trains, and you may engrave grand canyons at every dead made in your self-image, a martyr, martyr, made from a miracle three. Your future past tense friends may not be all that comfortable with your occupation. Your flock may spread wings and fly in every direction distant from you, carrying resentment, misunderstanding, and or envy farther away from your cherished memories with every pump of their fleeing feathers for. The only absolute is that this industry will put your character on the line in a line of work that sets the standard for pretty when they tell you that you are only beautiful if you can turn your smile 10 degrees to the left, 10 degrees to the left, 10 degrees to the left. If you kill you, you'll be confronted by peers who did down stress with pills like lights in faded studio apartments. There will be days when you wish your hair was a little bit longer, your waist was a little bit thinner, and your love for yourself was a little bit stronger for all those nights. I want you to remember that you started your life as a little angel with trampolines for tibias and a grin that could light up Madison Square Garden. You remember how beautiful you were, are, and always will be. Because whether or not you reach red carpet glory, you will always be a star game.